remember the other half of that little hackberry crotch? Not little. Wasn't anything little about it. This is the other half. There wasn't much left to turn, but there's this much. So this is going to be the bottom of the bowl. This will be the top, and uh, we'll see what we can do with it. <laughs> I'm going to go use my brown paper trick and glue a block under here so that I can tuck it up and get this thing turned. This didn't glue up as true as I had hoped. That or it moved an awful lot on me, I'm not sure. But it's alright, I'll true it back up and we'll hollow it out. <laughs> Now let's face it off. Well, I guess we gotta saturate this buggy thing with sanding sealer. Tiffin up the bug holes if nothing else. And when that dries, I will come back. Let's get the face shield on and see if we can hollow this out. Well, my brown paper failed. That has not happened before. So, we do it again. Okay, let's try this again. It's out of shape again, or out of round. That actually looks really good, and the thickness is good. But before I start sanding it, I want to apply some Mylans to stiffen up all this bug goo and stuff. Alright, we'll let that dry and then we'll sand it up. I'll send this up to 600, I'll come back.
more Mylands. And after this dries, I'll hit it with some axe abrasive paste. And then I'm actually going to finish this little bowl with Hampshire Sheen. Once I get the Hampshire Sheen done on the inside, I'll take it off the waste block. And we'll turn it around, chuck it up, and finish the box. Okay, that looks pretty good, like it is, but we can make it look a little bit better yet. So I'm going to apply some Hampshire Sheen. That's this stuff. Now I'll apply some RPMs to heat it up. Now I will let this cool off to harden because it's still pretty warm. Anyway, I'll let this cool off to harden for a little bit before we turn it around. That's got a nice sheen to it. I like that. It wasn't going to be ultra shiny because of all of the bug stuff, but that is shiny enough, I think. So I decided to put this in my cold jaws. I think that'll work just fine. It's running pretty true. First thing I want to do is drill the recess for my logo coin and hopefully I won't go through the bottom. That should be deep enough. I've got a bit of a foot. It's a little out of round. It's probably due to how many times I've had to chuck this up. But once I finish shaping this bottom, it may not be out of round. I'm gonna have to do this slowly and gently, about 600 RPM, and I'm just gonna use the scraper. Just a tiny bit of an OG here on the outside. All right, let's sand it up. That's actually pretty good. I think I can start with 120. That's 600 and it looks pretty good. Mylands again. Hampshire Sheen. The more friction you can build with this, the better. Almost like a friction polish, but this is so much harder and lasts so much longer. And once you let it harden up after you've done this, you get no fingerprints. All right, now heat it up. And there you go. I've had pieces come out a whole lot shinier than this, but they weren't this buggy. And, and I took it a little bit further. This is shiny enough for this piece. Now I'll let that cool down and we'll glue my logo coin in. They got a few drops of thick Starbond CA, Starbond Premium Super Glue. Click the link in the description below. Get 15% off your order. No code to enter, just click the link. Hit this with some activator. Boy, it is just below the surface. But it's below the surface. That's all that matters. Not much of a foot on this little bowl, but you don't really need one. And there you have it. One little spalted hackberry dish.
I think it came out nice. Not terribly shiny, but doesn't really need to be. Very, very smooth. Feels natural, doesn't feel plasticky. And I almost didn't get this logo seated far enough. But I didn't come through the bottom either, and that's what I was worried about. So here's that little dish. Four and seven eighths inches wide, inch and a half deep. Again, spalted, hackberry, a little wormy. This is the other half of that one I attempted to do a heart shape out of. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to save any of the crotch feathering uh, or the figure from it, but it's, it's still a nice little dish, I think. I like it.